that's the problem. You don't have another starter that can come up and perform. So you're forced to go out there and go out and build through free agency. Who's building through free agency anymore, Michael? No one. No one. Did the Astros win because of free agency? Did Cleveland win because of free agency? Did the Yankees won because of free agency? No. They've won because they've used the pieces to make trades or the pieces they've called up and have hit. When have the, when have the Mets? Who are the big guns? Who? Right? Reyes? The three pitchers that they have now? I'm talking, I'm talking in the last 30 years, Michael. Who? What young Met has come up here and been great since Daryl and Doc? Who? Well, David Wright until he got hurt. David Wright gets hurt. Jose Reyes gets hurt. Right? Conforto, hurt. Syndergaard, hurt. Mats, hurt. Harvey, hurt twice. Who? So I'm talking 30 years. 30. Name them. On one hand, you can name them. And even the ones that you can name, no championships out of them. And, and sad story. I'm sorry, Reyes is a sad story. That's a sad ending. David Wright, that's a sad ending. And even Doc and Darrell didn't, didn't finish their careers here. Who's the forever player? Ed Greenpool? And they treat him badly. So, uh, uh, this, is my, this is my team. This isn't Yankee boy killing him. This is my team. Look around Major League Baseball. Where's their Harper? Where's their Trout? Where's their Altuve? Where's their Judge? Where's their Sanchez? Where? You, you can't even on accident? You couldn't fall into one? Who? I'm begging somebody to tell me who. And, and we've overrated these guys. Syndergaard, Mats. Oh, oh they're, oh, they're going to be Cy Youngs. They're going to be winning 20 games a year. I don't want to kill them, Michael, but we're still waiting. We're still, wa we're still waiting for Thor. The Dark Knight's gone out the door. Who? 30 years. 30. Carter, Hernandez, they got them. And they, those guys still didn't finish their career with the Mets. The Yankees have three forever players, maybe four or five before the season is over. In one year. In one year. The Astros have three. The Nationals have two. Of 30 years, the Mets have none. I can't. David Wright's your forever player. You lost. I love David. But if that's the best you can give me, you're then you're, you're, you can't win. Your forever player was Strawberry. And how did that end up? Daryl Strawberry writing ghost articles in 88 during the playoffs, how he longs to be a Los Angeles Dodger. How did that end up? Winning a championship with the Yankees. Yeah, that's not forever. Doc pitching a no-hitter for the Yankees. Strawberry won three championships with the Yankees, Don. Yeah, Don, please. Don't just make it one. All right, so 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 you understand where I'm coming from now, <laughs> right? Yeah. I bring up Ed Cranepool because poor Ed Cranepool came up when he was 17 years old, spent his entire career as a Met. When David Wright was breaking every offensive record, he was breaking Ed Cranepool's records, Michael. Ed Crane pool. Peter, Ed Crane pool. Did you ever hear of him before today? I'm not mocking you. This is not Casey Stengel. This is Ed Crane pool. Did you know who he was before today? I'm asking you. Before today, but not before I worked on the show. Right. Never. That's, that's your guy. That's your forever guy. Not Ruth, not Gehrig, not Mantle, not DiMaggio, not Barra, not Jeter, not Pettit, not Andujar, not... Torres, not Judge, not Bird, Ed Cranepool, Ed Cranepool. There's 90% of this audience right now that couldn't pick Ed Cranepool out of a lineup. If Ed Cranepool picked them up at the airport, they'd say, hey, dude, what's your name? Can you take me to Midtown? You played for the men. That's cool, man. When did you play for the Met? That's awesome, dude. That's your forever player. Ed bleeping crane pool. That's it. There's not one other one. Not one. And don't give me Reyes. Don't give me Reyes. And don't give me right. And when you say forever, you mean like, like so Tom Seaver is not that. They, they traded Tom Seaver away, Michael. They <laughs> traded him away. And then in 1984, he came back. He begged to be a Met in 84. Michael, he begged him. 
I want to come back to this piece of garbage organization just because this, the, these were my best days. And they left them unprotected, and the White Sox took them. The White Sox, though, you know what he did with the White Sox, Michael? Do you what? remember what he did? Do you remember win. what he did? 300th win. Against who? Yanks. Right in his hometown, right here in New York. Right here in New York. He wins his 300th game as a White Sox. Darryl, three championships as a Yankee. Gooden, no hitter as a Yankee. Nolan Ryan, seven no hitters. Not one of them is a man. Seven. Ed Crane Pool. Ed Crane Pool. That's your guy. That's who should wear a jersey. You should go to the stadium, Ed Cranepool. That's the guy. That's the Ed. There's no one else. There's literally, Michael, no one else. Kuzman was a twin. Bud Harrelson was a ranger. Do I go on? Do I go on? They killed Gil Hodges. Nothing's good. There's no good. Not one thing is good. RJ, do you have the uh, new sounder? 76 days, Michael K. Wow. No rant. I, I knew today was I the need. day. 76 days, there's, the longest he's ever made it until Ed Crane pulls and the New York Mets took Don out. Now, I rant and I lose it, all right? And sometimes I lose what I say. Anything I say incorrect. Was there anything that I exaggerated? Well, anything yeah, at well all? they killed Gil Hodges. That might have been rough. <laughs> <laughs> no, but he, he uh, died on the golf course. But he huh? died. But he, he died in Met Spring Train. Well, the, the, one of the greatest first basemen of all time. You that, okay? This is what Oregon no, breath, just, I'm just saying, and I, I had no intention of even bringing Ed Creampool up today. Poor Creampool. But I started thinking about it. They, they, that's all there is. There's no one else. Remember Dave Magadan? No. I do. Didn't I remember make him. It. Didn't make it. Michael, he didn't make it. Mike Piazza didn't even finish his career here. Ed Cranepool does not have a Twitter account. Well, Ed's actually feeling under the weather. He, he's looking, you know, he's trying, all serious, he's trying to get a kidney transplant. Oh, really? Yep. Well, I love Ed Cranepool. I was, I was, he hit a home run, my first Met game I ever went to in 1972. But is it wrong to want better? Is it wrong to want better for 50 years of watching a team? Do I deserve better than Ed Cranepool? Tremendous human being, Michael. Peter, would you Michael, please pay attention to Don? He's you, having trouble breathing. You have yeah, he's, five, he's, the Yankees have five forever guys on the team now. <laughs> right? well, Peter, at this second, on this second, at this second. Well, but when you say forever, do you mean forever, ever? He means a guy that started with the team, ends with the team, and is like their well, so guy can, that you could grasp. Well, how can you, so who are the five that you're saying are necessarily that? Oh, so you think you think Judge? No, think Judge will be, be stupid enough judge, to trade Judge away. Judge will be forever. Are you saying already? You think Glaber is a? He's forever? on his way. He's on his way. Okay, keep going. Gary Sanchez. You don't, th you Gary don't think Gary Sanchez Luis is going to be a fair, forever guy? Are you sure? Do you, believe, do you believe that the Mets? You can't be sure on something. The Mets. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We're talking to Mets. The Mets, they're going to the playoffs. They got Harvey, they got Syndergaard, they got DeGrom, they've got Mads, they've got Wheeler. Michael Pineda's better than all of them. Not Nobody, Michael Pineda. No, no, not Michael Luis Pineda. Severino. Luis Severino's better than all of them. And give, when Pineda comes back from his Tommy John, he's going to be better. The Yankee fans didn't even know who Severino was when the Mets were getting all these guys. He was in the bullpen when he first came up. Now he's the best pitcher in New York. Uh, we, have, we have to let Don catch his breath. I don't think you should. Yeah, I we'll think be this back. should go the on Michael, until it peters out. Michael Casio on 98.7 ESPN is brought to you by Geico. The real value in car insurance isn't how much you save. It's also the kind of service you get. Good thing Geico's been perfecting both for over 75 years. You really can see the assassin in Peter because Don is really... He's gasping for air, and Peter's looking at his phone like he's waiting for a, a, an Uber. Uh, we'll be back, see if Don makes it. <laughs> what does that mean? He's, he's waiting for an ambulance. Is there like a I'm checking. For ambulances? Just making sure I got someone hey, close by. The 911 app. Kayla Greco, Rosenberg, and you on Yes, and I'm ESPN. <laughs>